Martin, another pre-season tour out here in the, the sun of Barbados. Not a bad place to start the season. No, we had a bit of rain yesterday, didn't we, which just delayed practice a little bit. But, um, you know, fantastic again today. So it's perfect for the lads, uh, you know, in the first outdoor match of the season. And they all seem in good spirits around the hotel and around uh, today's game. Everybody seems to be chirpy and looking forward to the summer. Yeah, very much so. Um, you know, the boys have worked hard all winter and, um, you know, they're looking forward to, you know, getting into match practice now. And as you said, there's a good spirit amongst the, amongst the group and we're, um, you know, we're really looking forward to the summer ahead. Is it a slightly different role for you with Jason and uh, Paul coming into the setup? Yeah, it is. Um, you know, we obviously, um, the guys have got specific roles now with, with first and second 11. Um, so it is, it is a little bit different for myself, but, um, you know, I'm really enjoying um, having the guys around. Um, you know, they've made a really positive impact since they've, since they've come in and obviously, you know, had vast experience, um, you know, both domestic cricket and, and international cricket. So, um, you know, things have shaped up really well. Spoken to a number of the players and they all mentioned the impact they've had and it came at the right time and the changing coaching setup. It's given them a new lease of life, something else to concentrate on. Yeah, very much so. I think, you know, um, some people kind of think that the relegation hastened the change in the in the coaching setup, but that's absolutely not the case. You know, it's something that was discussed for a couple of years and you know the board were, were definitely keen on getting a more efficient streamlined structure with specific responsibilities and um you know, that's what we've done now and, you know, I'm delighted with, with the personnel that we've got in and, as you say, you know, the lads have really taken to them positively and, uh, you know, it's been a pleasure so far. What do, what do Dizzy and, and Fabi bring to the side setup? Well, they, they bring a, a freshness, obviously. Um, you know, people from outside the club, um, which I think is, is a good thing. Um, but they bring experience, you know, and, and presence. You know, from the experience that they've had, and the um, you know, obviously Fabi's worked at all levels of the game, from from junior cricket right through to international cricket. Dizzy's been part, obviously, of one of the best Australian sides there's ever been, arguably one of the one of the better sides in world cricket, um, as well as his own obviously qualities as a as a fast bowler. So he's got great standing within the game. Um, so that that brings you know its own kind of clout, if you like, but. Um, you know, the, the good thing is that we all sing from the same hymn sheet. We all have the same ideas of how we feel the game should be played. And, um, you know, we're all working towards the same end. And uh, as I say, it's the, I think it's the experience that they've got at, uh, at the highest level, um, which is you know, the most helpful thing. Yorkshire, this is Yorkshire day one behind you at the moment. There's plenty of uh, competition for places. Has that first team been picked yet? Not at all, no, 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 it's a, it's a blank piece of paper at the moment and, you know, we're looking forward now as coaches, you know, we've obviously done a lot of work indoors and a lot of practice and we're looking forward now to sitting down and watching the lads perform over the next couple of weeks and it's going to be very interesting to, uh, you know, to see how that goes and as you say, you know, the boys out here know that they're fighting for places. So runs and wickets out here could force somebody into that side? Yeah, very much so, um, you know, that's why we're here. Um, you know, we're not here just for a jolly. It's lovely to be here, of course, but it's it's about working towards that April 5th and, and the rest of the season. And you know, the lads know that their performances here do matter. And how easy is it going to get be to get promotion from Division Two back into the first division of the Championship? Well, it ain't going to be easy. You know, it's, we've got no divine right to be in the first division. Um, you know, so we're going to have to play well. But you know, I'm very confident with the with the squad of players that we've got that if we play, you know, to our capabilities. Um, then we're going to be up there challenging, um, but you know it ain't going to be easy. You know it's not just a foregone conclusion. We're going to have to uh, to really work hard and play well. well enjoy the rest of your tour and good luck for the summer. Thank you, James.